For our chicken cacciatore, we're going to need some bone-in chicken thighs with the skin removed, a diced onion, diced bell pepper, a diced carrot, sliced mushrooms, fresh thyme, fresh basil, fresh parsley, some red wine, some crushed tomatoes, some tomato paste, some red pepper flakes, and olive oil. So I have some olive oil heated up over a medium high heat and so I am going to add my chicken thighs to this which I've seasoned with a little bit of salt and pepper. And generally you're probably going to use about six to eight thighs based on the size. So we're going to let this go about six minutes per side, and then we're going to start mix, uh, cooking down our vegetables. All right, so our, vest, our vegetables, our chicken has been cooking on both sides for about five minutes, which we removed this up to the side. So now we are going to add in our onions, and we are going to cook these for about five minutes till soft. So these have been going about five minutes and now we're going to add in our carrot and our bell pepper. And we're going to let that go for about five minutes also. Okay, so now we are going to add in our mushrooms. And our fresh herbs, our thyme parsley, and basil. And I may have gotten those backwards. Give that a quick stir. And our garlic. And we're going to let this go for about another five minutes. Alright, so this has all been going for about five minutes. So now we are going to add in a cup of wine. And we're going to give that a good stir. And we're going to let this go for about another five minutes. So now we're going to add in our crushed tomatoes. Get all this goodness out. <laughs> Our tomato paste and our red pepper flakes and we're going to give this a good mix see if we need any salt and pepper but I think it's pretty much good mm. all right 
So we're going to let this go for about 10 minutes and then we're going to add our chicken back. So our sauce has been going for about 5 minutes so now we're going to add our chicken back in. And we're going to also add any juices that are in the bowl. Because that's nothing but flavor. Give this a quick little stir. Try not to make a mess because red sauce always has a tendency to go on to stuff. Especially if you're wearing white. So now we're going to turn this to low. And we're going to put a lid on this and let this go for 45 minutes to an hour. Okay, so this has been going for 45 minutes. Let's have a look at it. All right, perfect. Oh yeah, chicken is nice and tender. Now, if you find that your sauce is a little too thick, you can always add about a cup of chicken broth to it to thin it out a little bit. So let's get this all plated up. All right, so now that everything's done, we're gonna go ahead and get plated up. So we're gonna serve this up with some wide egg noodles. And if you want, you can use um, regular spaghetti noodles, totally your call. And we're going to get us a thigh, set that up right here, and then we're going to get us up some of this sauce. And there we go. Now we can eat. All right. Now that we've got everything done, I want to thank y'all for watching. Also wanted to express my thanks to each and every one of you who helped to support my channel. And as always, remember to be nice and be kind because it could change someone's day. And also enjoy cooking in the kitchen. Until next time.